Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Supergeek. Lenovo introduced three new laptops in the market under the IDPad series. These are the IDPad 5 Pro, 5i Pro and the IDPad 5G. I know one of these three laptops name sound different because it is a different than your usual laptop. Now first we're going to talk about the IDPad 5G, then I'll tell you about the other two. So IDPad 5G is an always connected laptop. If you don't know what an always connected laptop is, these laptops runs on ARM based chipset. The IDPad 5G comes with a Qualcomm Snapdragon 8CX processor which is a 7nm chipset and since the TDP of an ARM chipset is really low, it creates less heating. And since it creates less heat, these devices comes with a fanless design. It's just like your phone, it doesn't need a fan to cool down, just a large surface area to dissipate heat. In your phone, you have the display or the rear panel to dissipate heat and in these always connected laptops, you get an even large surface area to dissipate all that heat. Now moving further, this laptop comes with an X55 modem which means it is 5G ready but surprisingly it does not come with a Wi-Fi 6 support. Now for the rest of the specifications, the IDPad 5G comes with a 14 inch FSD display with 300 nits brightness and 100% sRGB coverage. It comes with decent webcam for video calls. The laptop weighs around 1.2 kilograms and is only 15 mm thin. The battery is 51 watt hour, which seems small, but since it is an always connected laptop, it can last more than 10 hours on Wi Fi. We still don't have the numbers with the 5G on. The laptop can be charged via a USB Type C port using the 65 watt Rapid Charge Express Power Adapter. This laptop comes in a 4G variant too but that variant comes with Snapdragon 8C chipset. Now if you don't want to jump on the ARM based Windows laptop wagon yet, then you can go with the IDPad 5i Pro or 5 Pro. Now starting with the IDPad 5i Pro, it comes with a 16 inches 2.5K resolution 120Hz display. There's an option with 14 inches 2.8K resolution and 90Hz refresh rate. Now for the guts, this laptop can be configured up to Intel Core i7 11th generation processor and NVIDIA MX450 graphics. For memory and storage, you can get up to 16 gigs of memory and up to 1 terabyte of M.2 storage. It comes with 56.5 watt hour battery for the 14 inches and 75 watt hour for the 16 inches one. It comes with Thunderbolt 4 port which can also be used for charging the laptop. Now for the IDPad 5 Pro, this laptop comes with Ryzen H series processor, we still don't know which one. It comes with the same display options like 5i Pro, but the 16 inches one in the IDPad 5 Pro can be configured up to RTX series GPU. Well, the pricing and availability are yet to be announced, but I'm hoping for the IDPad 5G to come to India so I can at least try it once. I wish I would review it for you guys, but that won't be happening anytime soon. So that's it for now guys, hope you liked the video, hit the like button, get subscribed and I'll see you in the next one.